Hello guys and welcome back to another Let's Play with me, English Jason. And today we're going to have a look on uh, One Way Heroics. Uh, yes. Uh, I saw this game on Steam and it looks like, uh, like one of the old JRPGs. Uh, but as you're going around questing, the it looks like this, the screen catches up to you, so you got to go just just the one way, like the the old uh, side scrollers. Uh, look quite interesting. So uh, let's go to options. Alright, uh, let's uh, start a new adventure. I don't know how I can continue an adventure, this is my first time playing. But, uh, okay, start a new adventure. There we go. Um, choose a name. So, like, look cool. Oops. Oh, accidentally pressed green shot there. Um, let's call him Les Jason. There we go. Uh, the other name would have been. Onyx, if I couldn't fit that in. Uh, and anyone that has been on my website, illustration.com, by the way, uh, will see a bunch of comics that I've drawn, uh, written, drawn uh, about Onyx printing. Anyway, uh, let's pass. So, let's do Right, you have spent your days in the castles fulfilling your duties at night. Damage reduction when using shields is to the normal rate. The great wall skill helps make this class the ultimate defensive fighter. So that's with good equipment and it's recommended for beginners. Well, we've got the female, male, female, swordmaster. You are, tra you are a traveling swordmaster. Your combo hit rate is twice that of other classes. You can also use the Berserk skill to power up your attacks. You are the ultimate potion fighter. Your stamina and weight limit are also high. Okay, so you can either go a sword master or a knight. Which is I sound like uh like uh, I would imagine like some sort of uh like a DPS kind of or oh, a tank I, I, I'm guessing. Um so look. Ooh, I don't know. Right, we've got the knight. It says uh, recommended for beginners. We are a beginner, so we'll go the knight. Choose perks. Okay. Can you say anything? What have we got? Oh, it's about on the way training. Ooh. Okay. Uh, you can just go on your book studies, everyone level it right now. Items item identification rate is increased by 10% each level. ST needed for skills is reduced. What's ST? I don't know what ST is. You are extraordinarily fleet footed, add one level to it. Agility rate in each level increases combo hit chance by 5% and makes all other actions quicker as well. Okay, Vitality, you have very tough physique, as one level's Vitality rate in. The amount of life recovered on the hour is increased by 1 and damage taken is decreased by 2% for each level. I read that one. Your ability concentrate is unparalleled at 1. That was willpower. Force power is increased by 30% over the level 0 range. And critical rate chance. Okay. What was that? Your presence brings a sense of security to others, making it easy for them to trust you. What else before now? Trap has a reduced. Okay. That's cool. Survivor, a survivor to the very end. This perk awards you. Increased vitality and stamina, 30 day mana, blah, blah, blah. plus 30 life at the beginning of the game uh, could be useful. Um, 
but I think we will go with... Maybe strength. Um, with intellect. And vitality. There we go. Okay. So we should do some extra damage, have extra hit points, and uh, what was it left again? Right, identification. Right, we change. Oh no, I've taken them all off. Damn it. Right, strength. We'll go with vitality. We'll go with Charisma, let's reduce prices, there we go, that'll be fine. Start adventure. Choose a new dimension to adventure and create a new random world. Imagine you input the dimension you would like to travel to. No, it's not a bad dimension, blah, 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 blah. The pirate Ne Yang and the adventurer Luthford stand before a sign that points the way to. Really? How can you say that? Six, six Bimas. Wild. Ne Yang. So, how exactly are you supposed to pronounce that? Luthford? Who cares? Let's just hurry and get out of this desert. I care. How are you supposed to ask directions if you get <laughs> That's it pretty good. It is pronounced Zix, Zixby Maz. Oh, come on. It's obviously pronounced Kaldun. What? <laughs> Wait, oh, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> Wait, what? How? None of those letters are even in the name. It's the language of the gods, man. Don't question it. You have no idea what it says, dear. I. I, I can't read. Okay, this is pretty good so far. A bit of humor. Um, Naughty King Victor. Hero illustration. I thank you for coming in our time of need. I'm the king of this land, Victor. Uh, as you are already aware, this world is being consumed by an unknown darkness. It has already made its way to the gates of my castle. Please, I beg of you, find a way to defeat the Demon Lord and bring peace to this world. It is only a small token, but allow me to bestow a few items to help in your journey. A few simple healing medicines and herbs. I know it will be a tough journey, but we leave the destruction of the Demon Lord up to you, Mistress. I will be leaving this castle behind as well. I hope we are able to meet once more. Now it is time to depart. I pray for your success. Okay. Oh, we got a fairy. Uh, hopefully she's not as annoying as the one in Zelda. Okay. Use the arrow keys to move in front of NPCs. Press Z or enter to talk to them. Once you have finished chatting, make sure to keep going to the right. Time stops when you're not on the move. Okay, this is interesting. Oh, I see. Okay, you can you can see it kind of moving. You can open treasure chests and boxes using the lock picking skill. I, do I have it? If you don't have the lock picking skill, you can still break them open through brute force. You can destroy walls in the same fashion. Okay. <laughs> okay, you see two hundred. Oh, 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 what was that? Need a fruit vial of healing. Okay. Oh, this is this is not going to be getting judge charisma. 
Oh my, it looks like your crew is at level 2. You are one, you are one people can depend on. Most people will want to join with you unless they are completely antisocial. Although the biggest problem is finding anyone at all in this crazy world we live in. When you want to change direction, press the arrow keys and see or change the code doesn't use it. Okay, so what was that? C or shift. Alright, okay. Okay. That's cool. We are already on the brink of destruction. Move the castle and head right. The battle with the demon lord will be a drawn out fight, but even a pinprick draws blood. Keep at it and the demon lord will succumb. We will stay here and sh share our fight with the castle. What? Please finish the life for us. Why don't you just all move? Oh, I don't like that. It's getting a bit close. Knights excel at defensive abilities with it. With clad use of heal items, they can stand toe to toe with the demon lord. They are also the cl the class with they are also the class with the highest survival rate when surrounded by enemies. It's because they're a tank. Get oh. Oh, it feels like Doctor Who with that. Oh, it's like a, that wall thing. But the, the, I don't know. You know what I mean. Watch Doctor Who. You may. I've already figured it out, but Z or Enter is the attack button to defeat all the that oppose you. If an enemy approaches you diagonally, it's crucial to face diagonally while holding C or Sh. Oh, yeah. oh right, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay, that's fine. What's, what's this guy? What's this guy? You are leaving me behind as well, aren't you? Oh, sensible old lady, I feel like too. There is no way I can run from the darkness. So I will at least do my part by telling you about up and current upcoming areas. Location of real small very big town, small very mini map of days with my mini map. I don't know where my mini map is. Well I guess this is goodbye for me. Do your best to reach the end. Madam. Okay. scary. If you need to talk to me, press X to open the menu and look for speaking of Iris. This menu is also where you can use skills and items and change equipment. Okay, so press X or skip. Oh, okay. Okay. That's cool. Um, awakening. Who sees this? Level? Stops time for three turns. Your attack power is also increased. Whoa, this skill reduces this T. What is ST? I don't know what ST is. Okay. And all right, heal moon. Speed with Iris. Speed with Okay. What's this? Okay, we're getting ahead now. We're getting ahead here. It's possible to enter bodies of water and mountains. However, if there are enemies around, they get knocked by shadows to attack. So be careful. Oh, you're not very nice orc. Orc, you got to be an orc, surely. Bang, right oh, yeah. here. Okay, beat you. Tough him. Okay. Boom, oh, reach level two. Well, hey, intellect level increased by one. Okay, we just keep hitting this guy, these guys. How oh, many bloody monsters are there? Oh, I don't like that. I around, I think. You shield the block, yes. Okay, just keep going, keep going. Just keep hitting them. Keep hitting them. Whoa. It says, you entered the stone dungeon. The air is more than I Pretty partially said her axe was a lumberjack's axe. Okay, this is stuff I'm gonna take, is it? No, I don't know. Ah, pick up, yes. This is a suspicious pill that tra tra transports the player to a new location with no memory of how they got there. However, it only works on living objects and can be used on golems, doors, or chests. Well, we'll take that. Uh, um. Object 
And X primarily used for fending trees, it is not zen for battles and for the night where we are Stones, a stone which can be thrown at enemies for damage. It does more damage than you would expect. Okay, well, we'll have that. It's my weight. Ooh, I got very close to my weight in it. Ah, that is. That's what we want. Throw. Boom. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Oh. Uh. Throw life. Hundred life. Do a little bit of wandering. Feral dog, okay. Uh, oh. Okay. For the big stone in. There we go. Ooh, level 4. I didn't even realize I'd gone to level 3. There we go. Uh, where am I going? don't know. Snowfield's giant drains energy. Okay. That's water. Okay, so we've come to another little dungeony thing. Which looks. Oh, what's that? There's a plant. What's that do? Yay, healing herb. Oh, cool. Okay. Now back through the dungeon. Map area one. Who's. Get the hang of it now. What? How much damage did that do? Right, eat that. No! Oh, look the other way, you fucking idiot. Um, can I go? Here we go. Nice. Boom. We're out the way. We're out the way. That's cool. Yeah, like a punch come back or not. Ooh, that was a bit tough, man. Okay, I'm getting ahead now. I'm getting ahead of the darkness. Which is what we what we want. Um we're losing energy. What do we get? We've got to get out of the snowfield. So tired. We need food! Maybe that. Oh, it does energy by 70%. Okay. So, let's use that. Like that. There we go. We're back up to full. Okay. That's cool. Uh, doesn't really seem to be any... Seems to be a dungeon coming up. A very small one, maybe. Ooh, a weapon. Love that. Bow. Okay, yeah, we'll have... Can we have that? Yeah, we can have that. Uh, put that in. Can you equip that? 
Did I take... No, I took... Right, okay. Aha, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it's called. I'm going to the arrows. That's not good. I have to go back to the sword. Okay, here we go. Oh, there's a small... What's that? Oh, okay, this is the forest. Evasion plus 10%. That's down in uh, the right hand bottom corner there. Kind of telling you what, what's going on. Which is uh, nice. Ooh, there's a f thing. What's this? What's this? Oh, it's a tough one, isn't it? One damage. Okay, what's this do? Oh, oh, I see. These are like super chests or something, are they? Let's have a look. Where we go? Where we go? Skills here. Alright, let's talk to you. Oh, you're under me. I can't believe you've found me for two days. Well, I can't believe you're doing much. I'm supposed to help you on your journey. So, any questions for me? Nothing? No, no? Wait, are you actually ignoring me? Phew, maybe I should find a new job. Find a new job. New job. Anything I can help you with. Uh, do you have a question? Can you tell me more about the snowfield terrain? What happens when I run out of energy? Give me some tips. Why is that clock in the upper right hand? I didn't even notice. Uh, let's go to the snowfield. So, so cold. Towns and dungeons actually show up fairly often in the snow terrain. However, you obviously won't find any. New to fruit lying around to make matters worse, and you place at a much faster rate in snowy areas. If you are unable to replenish your energy, the logical decision is to quickly pass through any snow field areas. Also, you might want to keep an eye out for polar bears. No one told me about polar bears. They are pretty tough, so it is best to run away until you have sufficient equipment. What's wrong with my equipment? My equipment is amazing. Right. Uh, we need... What's that about? We want to move the clock. The clock on the top right? Oh, the worm clock. Yes. This clock is basically a time for when the demon lord will show up. It's really useful since you can prepare for his arrival if you keep an eye on the timer. When the white hand hits the... 12 o'clock position, the demon lord will appear. It's a good idea to prepare escape items and equipment before he shows up. Okay, well, we'll just run through this area. Oh, this loot. I see loot. Oh, and more loot. What is this? We'll have this leather armor. we we'll pick that. Oh no, we've gone over. We're not, we're not going to be able to move to so reduce your weight. Okay, we need to, uh, unknown quality, can't just equip it, what was that, what happened, don't know, uh, three armor, damage reduction of 6%, unknown, oh, no. oh, I knew it should have happened. Okay, we'll have to... Uh, mm. This mean item for your thirty percent Um... Right, well... It's, surely it's got to be better than Night's Code, doesn't it? Let's... let Wait, three. Wait, three. Okay, how do we drop? There we go. Okay, we'll run through there. Ooh, go upwards. Kill a dog. Is it a dog? There we go. Snow crystal grass. Okay. There's a flashing thing on the little mini map, so let's run. Let's kill dogs. 
bit of experience. Okay. On a plant. License online. Okay. Achievement. Get out of the way. Here we go. Pick up. Oh no, we can't. Damn it. Uh, what can I drop? What's that? The grass that is only found in snow here is eating every source of life and energy by 10%. Ooh, it can be sold though. So, this is a map that I'm going to look at around this using this. It's more of a bit of time, dungeon to the map. Can I use that? Use that. Boom. There you go. Hey. Is this a. How do we get in? No, don't die, people. No, no. Oh, I died. I died right up in there to die. When I black curtain pressing against your back, finally gets the best of you and swallows you whole. Almost immediately, you are crushed by intense pressure and sent flying into the air. From above, you can see the darkness assailing the land. From this new vantage point, you are able to spot something amongst the endless dark fog. A dragon. Larger than any mountain in the land is coiled up within a deadly fog. Oh, so that is what has been consuming our world? As you come to this realization, something solid slams into your body and ends your musings forever. Well, that was uh, not very nice. Yep, that was a pretty solid run. You uh, just keep up this pace and you'll save the world in no time. Alright. I'll settle down and get ready for our advice time. It doesn't look like you used your awakening ability this playthrough. You should use this ability like crazy when you are in a pinch. Ah, I forgot about that, that's why. If you are trapped behind a wall with nowhere to run, you may be able to use all of your awakening charges to destroy the wall and create an exit. Alright, oh, okay, okay. On the next room you will you can expand your dimensional vaults for the Let's try that again. On the next screen, you can expand your dimensional vault for the, the ability to carry items over to your next playthrough. Early on, it doesn't even cost any many points to expand it. Oh, okay. It's just like when I was keep trying and get better by okay by uh, keep trying and get better. Obviously, with practice, you'll get better. But uh, it doesn't look like you, you actually die, which is quite interesting. Uh, so, what else? What's what she saying now? Even just adding one weapon or item at a time can make the next adventure go a lot smoother. Give it a try. Well, that should be enough to do. Well, just keep up the adventure when you can. See you soon. Okay, oh. Night vision. C plus. Hopeful night, yeah! Heroics level 23.5. Okay. Um, we've got three to start the game with only three bonus perks. Journey of the uh, Unprivileged, no dimensional vaults withdrawal. Night in Shining Armor did not murder any friendly characters. Ah, well. Bow was revealed to be a hunter's bow, leather armor, was revealed to be a leather vest. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Hero points! Your hero point total increased by 23. Yay! A new record for night class has been added. Uh, use hero points. Post to Twitter. Hmm. Replay data. Um, use hero points. Spend hero points to expand upon your next playthrough. Your cur you currently have 23 points. Expand your dimensional vaults. Currently zero slots. Unlock a new perk. Unlock a new class. What have we got? Ah, oh, not enough. Who is it called? You unlock things. Ooh. Okay, let's go back. Unlock perks. Uh, still, not a lot I can do. Master of unlocking. That's what we want. Get through those things. Those uh, chests. Expand five points to expand. So if we expand it and get me take well, 
They said we take we can take weapons and arm them and stuff through, which is quite cool. Um, okay, the National Vault is a vault for carrying items over to your next playthrough. I should write that just now. There we go. Uh, punch these to expand five volts. Okay, let's do one. Um, okay, my first vault. Uh, achievement unlocked. The damage vault has expanded to one slot. Cool. Can we do it again? Ooh, ooh they get it. I don't think I need to do it again, do I? No. I don't know, I didn't really have any. Maybe the bow, the yeah, armor. Okay. Okay. Uh, bum, 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 bum. Turn to tile. Okay, so that was uh, One Way Heroics, and it was quite fun, to be honest. Um, I'll probably give a, put a link in the description to the Steam page where you can buy it for yourself. Um, or just carry on watching me playing. So I'll probably have another video up soon. Um, just to see what happens. Um, okay. So thanks for watching guys. And I will see you next time. Um, on One Way Heroics. Or any other of my videos that you might want. So uh, I'll see you next time. Bye bye.